Hello friends and welcome to a new video. Today we are going to talk about having multiple copies of the same movie. Um, why do I do it? So, I've only done it with a couple movies, not with a lot. Uh, one of the things that happens is with my premium ones, when I get it at one click, it brings all the different variations of the individual packages. So you get like the double lenticular, the single lenticular, the full slip, and it'll bring the same movie, the same steelbook some of the times. Some of the times it does bring a, a variant in there. Uh, but I want to talk about buying the individual ones. So let's start with John Wick, John Wick chapter three. But I did get uh, multiple ones, so I just show off. <coughs> So this is John Wick Chapter 3. This is the mini still book. And I believe this is from uh, Best Buy. Now we have John Wick Chapter 3. And that's the exclusive one from Target. Which is really beautiful. It brings its own plastic protector. After that, we have John Wick Chapter 3 from Best Buy, which is another excellent steelbook with this uh, artwork. I forgot the artist that did this style, but he did some amazing stuff with his painting. Some people don't understand it, but if you study it a little bit, you will understand how cool his paintings were. So very cool. And chapter three from Walmart. So this is the Walmart. Uh, big shout out to my family over there in the States because they were tracking these down for me. So why do I have these? <coughs> I had a, a goal of not double dipping, not buying multiple copies, but I did like the movie and I really couldn't decide which one I liked the most with these. So I bought them, I think almost all of them. There was a another John Wick that brought, I think, all three from Best Buy. It was another steel book. So I didn't get that one. I didn't like that the artwork as much. And then I had already four copies of it. So I think I am good for now. So that's the reason I bought them. It was the artwork. I was just, oh, I want this one. Oh, I I couldn't decide. So I just went ahead and bought them. <coughs> I also got the mini one for chapter one and two. So now I have like all of them in a still book format. I just don't have them in a big format, uh, the one and two. So that's one of the reasons. Uh, the same happened with Spider-Man, Far From Home. This is the Mexican version. Yeah, I bought this one in Mexico, mix up. I think there's also a European version, which brings 4K. This one was just regular blue ring. This is the Best Buy exclusive that did bring, I believe, 4K. Let's see. Yeah, this one brought 4K. So that was another reason. And then I got this one. And I don't remember this was 4K. I think this was just regular Blu-ray. But this one brought four movies. So that's why I went ahead and picked this up. And yeah, this is just Blu-rays. <coughs> so in here we have Far From Home. So I have three different versions, you could say. And I know there was a fourth version of this style um i did see it in a mix up here in mexico but i decided not to get it i already had enough copies so that's another reason is that i got the 4k one because i really like this movie and i wanted it in 4k and i really liked this one too so i went ahead and just got this one so those are my two movies that I have the most. I, John Wick has to be the one that I have the most. That's four copies at least in here. <clears throat> uh, far From Home, I have 
at least three copies. I think I have it also in a regular case, I think, if I remember. But that is that that is the reason. And I noticed something here. So the Spider-Man ones have on the bottom of the steel book, like steel book number. And it says Marvel and all related. And the John Wick ones do not have the steel book. All right, guys, that is it for today. Happy New Year's. Thank you for supporting the channel. Thank you for being part of the community. Please subscribe. Please comment. Which which of these do you like the most? Do you like the John Wick ones? Which one do you like the least of these? So we have the Target, Best Buy, and Walmart exclusive. Walmart is getting into the Steelbook game. So that's it for today, guys. Catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.